win story. <laughs> the chicken of tomorrow in a deadly battle against the chicken of today. Dedicated to the chickens who lost their lives in the Great Chicken War. Wait a minute. Men and women breeding better poultry? What kind of sick experiment is going on here? You know, this music helps chickens breed. It's kind of like the Luther Vandross of chickens. <laughs> Buck baby. Chickens are dining in front of a Susan Rothstein mural. <laughs> After all these years, whether the chicken or the egg came first is still the subject of a lot of good-natured debate. No, it isn't. But one thing there's no argument about. Chickens and eggs are the most widely grown farm products in the country. There's not a single county in the United States that doesn't raise them. <laughs> Daddy, must you sit in, in dinner? Years, this poultry business has become a moneymaker for farmers. Three billion dollars a year. And it's second only to dairying and beef cattle raising. Woohoo! We're going on a trip! Hey, where are we going? Woohoo! Chickens are shipped to the set of Oklahoma. I think the fella in white really likes us, Susan. Huh? Just to give you an idea of the size of this poultry business, Americans eat 140 million eggs a day. That's one for every man, woman, and child in the nation. These are your chickens on drugs. Chickens? Well, the per capita consumption is 25 pounds a year. Help me. Which means just about everybody must eat chicken at least once a week. Yes, indeed. Chickens and eggs are a big business. <laughs> Come on, the tickles. And like big business, there's a serious effort to improve the product. We're removing mealworms. A three-year program to breed a better chicken is now being carried on. Fellow poultry men, our cherished freedoms are threatened from all sides. I don't think I've got what it takes to be the chicken of tomorrow. I'd like to be the chicken of tomorrow, but how can I be more the man of today? And on large and small farms everywhere, the search for a better chicken goes on. There it is! Wait! No! There! Come along with us on a visit to one of the large breeding farms. Woohoo! See how the old-time barnyard flock has grown up. If you're nice, we'll hook you up with a milking machine. Of course, they have to be hatched before they can grow up. So, let's start at the beginning, in the incubator. I'm in the incubator now. Good chicks come from good eggs. Thank you, young man. Fertile eggs from hens with a pedigree. Oh, pardon the me. pedigree is important because in the search for a better chicken, it's breeding that counts. Hey, can I go to the bathroom? Oh, stay in there. Oh, come on, can I go home? Oh, the door's locked. <laughs> 